Learn how to exhibit your artwork in the hallways in your home. You understand? <coughs> this is the space you got to manipulate artwork to figure out, is this a good idea? Imagine you have a gallery, a small gallery, I don't know. Is this a good idea? It's the same artist, he's having a solo show, to hang this, but it's realistic of his work, next to this very conceptual, we don't even know it's an, if it's he, artwork, he says it's his artwork, you understand? Next to flowers and all kinds of abstract landscapes, and some conceptual anthropological studies, statements, Gaia, you understand? So there is a group of subject matters of diversified colors, textures, and subjects. How this is supposed to fit with the next door guy? You want to sell all of them. Get it? Of course you do. So how do we emphasize the power, the beauty of that guy next to who? She should be sitting so people will definitely pay the price you're asking, you understand? The merchandise in the store are not placed by accident. It's a psychological game the stores, the retail stores play. And perhaps you don't know this, <coughs> but... In art galleries, the artworks are selected the, the, by many people, not just one guy. Because the show, rent costs $20,000, they need to sell at least $50,000 because they're going to give you $20,000. Then they need to rent and other expenses. So they need to sell $100,000 a month. How many paintings do they need to sell? So they need serious money for a piece of shit like this, you understand? Does it make sense? There are many people who make those decisions, but you need to learn those things while you're still alive and young in high school, while you still have walls and time and you're not student homeless bump, okay? You need to learn this because when you go out in the world, I'm going to be showing you shit first on all kinds of flea markets, art fairs in Texas with cows and pigs and shit and ask $200 for it. You want this, look the best outside at that art fair, okay? And you need to know which it needs to be set up. Should it be like bushes behind it on those easels? Okay, should you have this framed or should you bring it on a, on a, on a foam board and pin it like this? Should you bring anything framed? I saw one artist bringing 20, 30 frame paintings. Frames get damaged when you bring them outside and you put them on a the sidewalk or shit. You understand? You need to think about things like this. Down the ground, grass, grassroots, the beginning of your career starts right here in this fucking corner in your living room where you get...